I'm Anton Pruden and I'm a goldsmith and silversmith here in Ditchling and I've been a full-time craftsman here for 28 years. My grandfather was Dunstan Pruden. He was the silversmith on the Eric Gill community on Ditchling Common. He was particularly taken with the idea of an alternative lifestyle. He said in his autobiography that he wanted to reject the dreary agnostic socialism of the time and come down and live a life where art and craftsmanship can be the centre of his life. You get to the stage where your material is as close to the finished product as it can be before you do anything else. One of the joys about goldsmithing and silversmithing is the materials. They are fabulous materials to work. We work them cold. Um, they're ma malleable in their own cold state. It's about hammering the metal solid and changing its dimension. Our next stage of working is the heating of the metal. What we do is we bring it up to red hot and that remixes up the structure of the atoms and makes it soft again. Cool it down, work it cold. One of the things about the guild ethic was that the bench skills that we learned were always perfect. The guild's ethic of what they called worship through work is still alive today. Removing metal is the next stage where you've got excess. So the process of altering the shape of the metal is a, is a slow process that feeds back to you all the time. Even polishing is removing metal. Polishing is an intrinsic part of our skill. It's not something you just do a little bit at the end. You polish pretty well all the way through the process. Things can be over-polished, and over-polishing has always been an issue and a bit of a bugbear of my grandfather. Hence, you see the hammer marks left in most of our work. Leaving hammer marks in is a reflection very much of the guild ethic. As we grew up, we got to see the passion and the dedication that the guild members had, and we really took that to heart. I'm very proud of the legacy that we have then carried on. We can hand that on to our children. I think it will continue for a long time. <laughs>